right side. But it's the biggest game of the weekend. When the chips are down, get your chips, chips up. up. Welcome, it's Chips episode 12. I'm James Levine. We're back in second, we're moving back up. What's up? I'm Trevor. Uh, it is what it is, you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Nice, solid, solid, solid. Yo, intro. my name is Timo, and uh, I got my chips up, baby. <laughs> my name is Danny. <laughs> <laughs> I got my chips down. <laughs> it is when the chips are down, where you can week to week get your chips up and get your chips down. Uh, the best example we have of this. Danny was riding in first place for seven weeks. Eight weeks. Eight, eight weeks. Excuse At least get it right. <laughs> and is now, this is a, a, a fall off of epic proportions. The 30 for 30 coming out of the end of season one of the fall of Danny. But it's Chips. Let's go ahead and start and uh, let's bring you the rules. We all started with 1,000 BSBs. Every week we had to at least put four, four bets up. We started with 10%, uh, 20%, I believe. We are now up to 50%. Woo. Of chips you got to put up every single week. Since it's when? getting down to Since the today, baby. Since today, baby. So That's you know what it is. Hockey seat, uh, playoffs, baby. We have, um, you know, if you lose, if you lose all your BSBs here, you will have to eat a chicken wing to get BS. We have our guest Trevor. He has 800. We're awarding him. He does have to use all of them today. Uh, and then if you lose the whole thing, of course. You will be having to put together an eight-team or eight-leg parlay for one game. If you hit it, you are safe. If you lose it, you do eat the one chip. And, of course, there is the Butters curse. So every week, Butters will try to fuck you. I promise that's cars in the background and not gunshots. Or <laughs> Actually, <both>. not sure. <laughs> you never. You want to be able to get away from Butters. He could be elusive with this pick, so you do get a chance at the end to to uh, fade the original pick of Butters, and you do have to two times your bet. Let's go to the standings. This is what I've been waiting for all day, baby. Nah, we can skip this portion. <laughs> we can skip this segment. Just keep the cameras on us. I mean, I'm technically ahead of Danny right now. I'm like, Shut, Shut up. up. <laughs> With your... Bada bing, bada bing, bada bing, bada bing. Ah. Do you have the, is the standings up? Ooh, I had a finger, um, but... Nope. You, you can, can see, see the standings. See, oh, there there right there. And the back of the screen. Fuck the camera. It's all right. The standings do say, and you can even just see it on the front, um, Stefan has uh, 1,363. I want to read this out very, very specifically. Um, <laughs> I have 970. Nice. Timo with the big Sounders, Real, Sounders, Pumas, over two and a half win, is got 970 right now. Uh, and big, big, Danny big, 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 is, big, big. let me see what that, I can't really read, 551. Oh. Is what Danny has a proud 551, right? 551. Proud. <laughs> <laughs> now let's take it to the marquee matchup. Of course, we have Stefan in first place. We'll get a call with him later, see what he's up to. But he's going all in. In our marquee matchup, you know what it is. We pick the top event happening and we put a bet that has to be 10%. Danny, when you want to know what that 10% is, let me know. Anyways, Doctor Strange 2 comes out this week. I didn't watch the first one. Uh, but we are going to, for our... Depending on what it, it he bets on, on is he going to watch this one or he's not going to watch this one? He's right. Trying to help the I got my BSBs up. I'm there second weekend. We are going to bet, is this going to have a better opening weekend than number one? I'm going to watch this shit 20 times this weekend. <laughs> for real facts, I'm going to be like, ah, let's try this. How much was that? 82? 80. What's the, how much was it first opening weekend? 85.1 mil. 85.1 mil. We're going over under. It's got to be 10% of it. Uh, we'll get stuff on later. So I'll actually, I'll let Trevor go ahead and lead off our marquee matchup. At least 10% or more than 10%? It could be as much as you want. At least 10% though. So, yeah, but you have to go all in tonight. So my whole thing with that is people want to get out of the house. They want to go see movies again. Multiverses are so big now. Like, even the everything, everywhere, all the time. Big multiverse. Awesome movie. Tremendous movie, actually. But multiverses are everywhere. The Spider-Man thing was coming in. So yeah. I think even if people didn't watch 
the original one. I think, honestly, if you watch the first one, you almost have to watch the second one. And I'm thinking it's going to attract more multiverse people. Just in general. Like, I went to go see Spider-Man. Loved it. Cult classic. Yeah, see what they bring Maybe 30% of those people didn't see Doctor Strange but liked it anyways. They're going to be like, look, let's go see this other one because now it has the multiverse, blah, yada, yada. For sure over. Put 20% of that. 20% percent Put 20% on over. on over for sure. Hammer, hammer the over. Over. Hammer. Uh, I'm gonna go second. You know that was kind of my thing. Is one, it's a it's a lesser Marvel movie and it's a sequel of it. But two, I think people want to go to the movies. I think right now there haven't been a lot of movies that's came out that's been new that's been super. I mean Batman, Spider Man, but this will probably be the third, if I'm not mistaken, this year superhero movie. Yeah. It's a lesser character though. Do I think that they're coming out to? But you bring up a good point about the the lesser known. Um, Marvel movies tend to have something interesting that somebody who even isn't like doesn't love Marvel it's like oh I like that point like I like um, the all black cast of Black Panther I'm gonna go watch it I like the uh, uh, people with the the first what was the one with the raccoon Guardian, oh, Guardian. Guardian. Yeah. people were telling me I loved it because of the soundtrack and I was like was the soundtrack that hard that they it had, had that people opening was... the opening the right uh, right shit what, what song was it uh, I know what song it is but I don't know the yeah, the one that he does in the Walkman, the opening scene. Yeah, right, that song was right. huge. Da, na, na, so um, na, na, na. I'm da, also going da, to smash na, 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 the over, and f- feeling the energy of my good friend Trevor. We're also going twenty percent on that. So for me, that's about we're gonna do it a clean two hundred on the over. Uh, yeah, I'm rocking over two. I just don't see how it could go under. Um, Everybody's doing it, so I'm gonna go twenty percent too. <laughs> Why not? Chips are up. Chips are up. So one eighty, one eighty. Gonna put on that. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, yeah. It's about twenty percent. Yeah, yeah. I want to stay with the chips high. Now, Danny, that's cute, guys. You know, as a high roller myself. <laughs> <laughs> that is cute. That is cute. That's twenty percent of five fifty one. Do math, bro. Um, <laughs> it'll be about hundred and ten dollars. This pretty much, uh, I mean, we're all we're, obviously. It looks like we're all rocking with the over. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So makes sense. Um, and it's literally just everything that that our special guest today, Trevor, said. Um, people want to know what's next, like uh, because of the multiverse, because of the Spider Verse, and all that. And then who, like, who is gonna make a cameo? You know, how many actors, characters are gonna make cameos? That's true. Uh, we already know like that. Who, who did we see in the? Uh, we already know that the Illuminati's there, which part of that Illuminati right. is Professor X. And mm-hmm. for people who try to skip the, spo- uh, the trailers and spoilers, <laughs> they saw him on the red carpet, Patrick Stewart, Sir Patrick Stewart. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, who knows who's going to show up? Even if it's for like two seconds, who knows who's going to show up because now everything and anything is possible in the MCU. Uh, but I'm going to go 25%, a little higher because I'm trying to get my chips up. Um, and if so, and if our producer needs to know how much that is, that's 138. <laughs> <laughs> so no, hold on, question: Have they been doing? Um, I don't, I don't think this is sensitive. Have they been doing Stan Smith still or Stan Smith? Stanley. Stanley's in. No. Okay. No. I'll say that'll be an interesting CGI Stanley. I don't, but I, he hasn't no, been in there. I, the I recent don't, ones, has he? No. I don't no, think so. Okay. No. Okay. And I don't even think they would even try to, to like, CGI or whatever out of respect. But okay. Yeah, nah. Uh, he's done, uh, obviously, he's done with the cameos. No, in your, because I, I kind of, after First Avengers, I fell off, watched some here and there. But I'm sure you've seen a lot of them, Danny. Have you, you guys, have you guys yeah. all seen, like, I've Pablo Cabello? I, I've seen uh, it. I've seen I just a very good saw Spider-Man. My guy's a big, big Marvel Recently? Girl. It was, like, yeah. the first yeah. one in a while? Like, do you, like, do you, like, watch uh, all the Marvel movies no, as no they come way. out? No, no. I've seen them all. Now, how do you feel, how do you guys feel about the idea of the multiverse? I feel like, and I didn't watch Spider-Man, but I feel like if you have the idea that you can have anybody in it, does it kind of cheapen a movie? Because you can really do anything because it can be an alternate universe. And is it does it lead you down a slippery slope? It does. Because, like, yeah, you will like to see these characters or whatever, but you may want to... Uh, as long as it, it's not like some like out of way out of left field kind of storyline that brought them in or like excuse or whatever, like I like it 
like everything is possible like you could bring animated stuff into it like and, and make it um uh irl or whatever or like live action right right, um, right. and that's what everybody's hoping for with these next two into the spider or it's called the cross spider Verse movie which is the two-parter um and they're hoping by the end of that which will be like 2024 is the second one that'd be the time where they introduce a live action miles morales because with the name title across the spider verse you're America. literally traveling through everything can't be him so, anymore so, bro one <laughs> well, he's already all that too in um and, over anyways in that spider-man movie uh with the the first one uh yeah he played that he the played he played the, uh the uncle the uncle be, um with, with his name and all he made the which, deal in the parking garage right? yeah, with yeah, the, yeah the prowler the prowler um i'm o i'm okay with it because like the thing is if you're a marvel fan or like a fantasy fan or a comic book fan you're a fan of multiple things like you don't just read spider-man or you don't just read whatever so in your mind there are a whole bunch of these universes anyways why not just say there's a bunch of universes and as long as they have one opening like it might be far-fetched and like a cheap way to combine all of them but the just the fact saying that they're they are they exist in separate entities or like i guess that's fine yeah i don't i don't mind it but it's also like Ah, just don't get too like Danny said. Just don't get too cheesy with it, and just be like, yeah, they can kind of exist, but it's like this dimension thing that very few th things or people can impact, and then yeah, you're good. And it's kind of like actual comics, like where like no one's really ever like fully dead. Like they'll right. they'll always bring a character don't, back. Don't they have a bunch of like Spider-Man and Superman comics or things like that? I don't know uh, the uh, comics I mean, very uh, well, but they have a lot of a lot a lot, comics, a, lot right? a lot of a lot of major characters have. Um, have died and come back in comics like it, like a lot so you can always like bring well, back right, right? let's say like robert downey jr for like from like a different timeline as tony stark and like playing you know yeah. doing like a two second cameo and everybody's gonna go wild right, and people right, are gonna spend right. money just to watch that in theaters you know or whatever right. so i like it just because you could bring that or like you could bring at least the character back maybe it's not the same in an actor, alternate universe so he's but not yeah Jr. like like, like the andrew garfield yeah like the rumor was like oh maybe uh Tom Cruise who played a Tony Stark at, from a different timeline, you know, like right, shit like that. Right, right. Like, so I'm cool with it just because it, it brings those possibilities. Because like, like in the comics, like, like I said, like a character die, like when they, whenever a character dies, they're never really dead because they always bring them back some way. So I'm cool with it. It makes it exciting. Timo, does that kind of move the dial for you? Like, does it make yeah, you want to watch know, more? Cool. Or less? I mean, I, yeah, probably. I don't know. It's just getting too much, I guess. I mean, it is overwhelming. But it just makes it people. seem like they're <laughs> running out of like things to like do for the movie. So it makes sense though, because like, when you see one more movie, come, they all kind of like tie into each other, kind of like, <coughs> all are the same in one way or another. Well, that's a that's the thing. Um, the the MCU uh, format formula, uh, for example, like uh, One Division and Moon Knight, they literally have the same format and all that. But hey, yo. It, if it ain't broke, don't fix it, man. This is what I think, though. The, the <coughs> one way we can get a Marvel versus Capcom movie, mm -hmm. I'm with it. That if we can hey, now that that's bring, possible, bring it back on the sticks. If now it's possible, bring back Street Fighter, exactly. Like bring, if that all could come yeah, through, and now that's a possibility to have a grand. Well, there was. Yeah. The grand fight. Yeah. Oh, there was a Chun. There's a Chun Li movie, right? There was. That shit. That shit flopped. But I feel I feel Timo and like, I remember when they started just pumping out. Like Avengers movies, I didn't watch them in time because I was like, I was getting Marvel fatigue. I was like, God damn, this is like the third fucking yeah, right. Revenge of Ultron, and then like this and Civil War, and, and then they started being smarter with it, be like, you know, we're gonna hit that. I watched one of them. You're gonna want to watch the next one because yeah, they're right, gonna exactly, be in it, yeah. and that made a lot more sense. But they, I, I get um, the fatigue from it. Though. They cashed out when they they hit the series. Mm -hmm. That was the big. I think the the biggest thing that they did was they were able to. Because a Marvel movie is, is you know, maybe four or five a year. But when you have a TV show, you're hitting them throughout the year leading up to movies. Now, they've, they've built out a money machine, if anything. And the way that those go, like, it's much easier to sit down and be like, oh, I'll throw on an episode, and I won't feel bad if I, like, am on my phone half the time. So I may not even care that much about it, but it's going to be, you know... Still engaged. It's gonna be on. Yeah, so I watched it. Right, like I right. got a viewership from it. Maybe I'll even watch it again because I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, right. honestly, Marvel can take the pandemic for that. Like because like they they couldn't make these big budget movies. Disney Plus for the show. And, and so they're like, all right, well, well we could do we could do these small, but like not small budget, but like these small feature things, and you know make these shows. So because shows, shows got pushed up and went while movies were getting pushed back. Right. Right. So right. yeah, and uh, what you're saying, and the cool thing, uh, well. 
Yeah. And you don't even gotta binge watch like that because like with Disney Plus, they're week they're taking they're taking them yeah. out weekly. Mm-hmm. You right, know? Right. So where like before with Netflix when I like Daredevil first came out or whatever and it was all season one, I'm like, fuck, like maybe like when I was in college, like and I had like time to kill, I could binge watch like all that one night. Right. Now that we're older, it's like, bro, like I gotta find the time to even watch one episode, one 45, 50 minute episode. And then like, I gotta try to avoid these spoilers because you got people that are right at midnight where you're like, I'm not even gonna sleep tonight. I'm gonna wait from 12 to fucking <laughs> 1 p.m. in the afternoon. I'm watching all of them right now. And You know, I've but, enjoyed that, that streaming services have started. Like Apple TV Plus does that, HBO does that. Because I feel like you're, even from a business standpoint, like Netflix will have a big show that come out like when you came out. It was it came out and like everybody watched it and it was the talk of everything for like a week. And then the next thing came out. Yeah. Like the next thing to put your attention to. So I think that with the weekly, you can get that old like, you gotta wait until like water TV. cooler talk like, yeah, everybody's at the same point. Yeah, exactly. There's no like spoiler of, yeah. of like, at this point, if you're getting spoiled, it's your fault. Like, yeah. you stay off the internet shit, but before you they could the be, mute words. Right, right. You know, <laughs> before, like Danny said, like the second day, somebody's already watched the whole series and broke everything down. You're like, yeah, I'm already right, episode dude. two. Like, like it, come on, man. It just started. Yeah, like, man. So you know, that, that's been kind of cool. Yeah, the one I really liked, though, that was on Disney Plus that I enjoyed for like probably my favorite Marvel film time was uh, the Loki series. Hey, that was a good series. Hard. That shit was fire. And what they're, what they're doing a good job is that they're not making it like an intimidating series. Like there's six, seven, maybe eight episodes. Like back in the day, like a season of anything was sixteen to twenty. Right. Yeah. Right. And now it's like they do it right doing it short though. Moon Knight yeah. Moon Knight the series just the season finale was uh yesterday it was six episodes. Yeah. You know that's okay. actually yeah. a um, I haven't checked it out. I was just it's a UK it's thing. Dope. Uh, that's what yeah. that's okay. Dude, they, they got it down. Way yeah. smarter than the right. second episode. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Like, because Hawkeye was eight. Yeah. Yeah. Eight eight, yeah. Same thing. Hawkeye like, made me watch uh, Daredevil on Netflix. Which that I was, was supposed to go watch that, that was weekend. Okay. Sorry, Christine, you be giving me some shit. I'll watch it, <laughs> I'll watch it soon, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> on that note, but, we're going to get to the next hey, one. Daredevil's we're, fire, though. Daredevil's yeah, fire. We yeah. have um, <laughs> our plus 1,000 of the week. Which uh, this is Trevor's first rock paper scissors tournament. Mm-hmm. Um, we are going to do what hockey team, what NHL team this week? That Saturday, Sunday, everybody plays. Just Which Saturday, team? Sunday. Yeah, the Saturday, Sunday games. What team will score the Ooh. most goals? Obviously, they're gonna have to win, but who will score the most? You and if it's tie, I'll let everybody win. And we can we can pull some BS pieces around. Everybody. Tie, so if everybody gets six, fine, go ahead. But we'll see. Or let's say if everybody gets six, it's who won by the most. So if you okay, won six to go. five, yeah, 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 yeah. or if you won six to, to one, one, that we was a better, yeah, yeah, that was a better one. Yeah, they know some favorites. So let's go ahead and. Oh, I got first. Who got last? They got first. Well, he starts. All right, cool. So it's we, rock, paper, uh, scissors. Uh, on scissors, you show what you okay. show. All right, here we ready? go. Here we go. Rock, paper, scissors. Ooh, Ooh, the, the newcomer. Double, double shish. It's a rookie. All right, cool, cool, cool. All right, let me wash it off. All right, here we go. Oh! oh what, what? I meant to go scissors. Yeah, yeah all right, cool. Right. I had a feeling. That was a, right. We almost had a challenge there. Danny almost had a challenge there. Uh, we ended up losing anyway. I've been, yeah, I've been doing it for the past two or three weeks. All right, here we go. Oh, sheesh. Yeah. yeah. I've been having a rough time with rock, paper, scissors. But <laughs> I've been practicing. Well, rock, paper, scissors. Are we going one, two, shoot? One, two, yeah, just one, two, shoot. Yeah, rock, paper, scissors. All right, go. One, two. Ooh, oh, scissors is hot today. today. Wow. <laughs> scissors, scissors, it came back. Okay. All right, interesting. One, two. Oh, okay. yeah. scissors, scissors. Okay. Respect the scissors. I respect the scissors. Okay, okay. One, two. Oh! oh! You didn't respect the scissors. I didn't think she'd go back. No respect the scissors. Alright. Damn, that was good. good. Hey, All left right. side back, back up. Left side back up. What's up? 50 is for you. <laughs> Ooh, double scissors. Oh, oh it slipped in the paper. Here we go. Damn oh. it. No respect for the scissors. <laughs> Sunny listed uh, Here we go. Oh! Bang! Back to back weeks. Back to back weeks. Let's go. All 
right. Left side though. We back up here. <laughs> top two spots. And fuck left side. Well, <laughs> I'm just gonna go with the team that's just been really hot. They just do a lot. They've been consistent all season. It's probably the safest bet in the sense of this. And I would hate myself that I didn't go this route, but Avalanche. No! Avalanche. <laughs> have to go Avalanche. It would be the dumbest thing to uh, do. It really would be. It would be the dumbest thing to do. Fuck. So let's see how they do. I got Saturday and Sunday for them to just, just actually just sweep them. Sweep them. They could. They right. could sweep them. Is that one today, right? I believe so. Uh, they, they were close 1 1. I will double check. Let's see. But yeah, I'm going to go with the uh, Avalanche. Fuck. And how much you got? How many BSBs you going at? Okay. Oh, we gotta go half, huh? Half today. Sheesh. If this, I got Colorado. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go 200. <laughs> I have to. If this right. is my best chance, I got right. first. If right. I have Colorado, this right. is as good as it's gonna get. If they lose, I lose. That's what it is. But this is the way to go sky high on this one. I'm going 200 on it. Ugh, I fucking nah, that was my pick too. That was a now um, I'm kind of like 380. Timo has up so far. Yeah. Now I'm kind of like uh uh. I might not do what I usually do and play a lot of bets today, but you know maybe just, just go high. On the ones you got. This is what I got. This was my first place pick. It's all good. Colorado, if you out there, man, just just do it for me, please. Okay, I'm stuck in between two teams right now. Ah. Uh, the I think they both play on Sunday too. Uh, I'm like Lightning, Oilers, oh, Lightning, oh, yeah. Oilers, Lightning. But I'm a, you know what? Only because they're gonna. Uh, okay, only because they're gonna be at home. Lightning. The next two games are at home. Right. So. All right. All right. That's yeah. a that's a really high scoring series, mm -hmm. and you right. could have went either way. Almost like winner of that game gets yeah. it. Yeah, so issue. I kind of wanted to go with the Oilers, but then they're going to LA, right? You know, right. so yeah. I rather I rather pick the team that has home 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 ice advantage. And I think LA actually is good enough oh, defensively to kind of. I know they got blown out last night, but I think they'll be able to keep up at home too. Uh, but your official is Lightning. Yeah. Okay. And how many BSBs on that, by the way? Uh, hold on, give me a sec here. I just gotta do my math real quick, cause I already put up one thirty-seven. How much did you put? Two hundred. Two hundred. If you're in the chat right now, let us know oh, who you got. Uh, but... there, it was score is one one actually. Predators. They're going into OT. Interesting. Yeah, so I'm glad that they had a slow day. Now right. that I picked this. Is that a super hot one? Yeah. That's good. That's uh, good. you know what? I kind of want to go higher, but I'm just gonna go. You know what? A hundred. <laughs> hey. I feel it. Hey, I feel hey, it. I have my chips like down that. before. like that sometimes when you're down bad. Yeah, uh, for real. Uh, <laughs> All right. A hundred. A hundred. A hundred. The thing is, they just... Yeah. Come on, Lightning. Come on. I need this. I need this. I, I like the Oilers. I think that was a... I wasn't even thinking Oilers, but that's actually a really good pick. Um. Oh, wait. It's me. Ah! Ah! He's been in first and second. Now he doesn't know what last feels like anymore. <laughs> not, he's about to go with the Oilers now. So I'm not a huge. So I'm not. I'm not a huge hockey guy. But I will say I had friend in in school. Uh, a lot of Minnesota guys. I was gonna say the Wild. A lot of Minnesota. And they play guys. Sunday. Oh, oh shit. yo! Have you been watching? Cap I don't watch much hockey, but I do love Kaprizov and I love Eric Snack. Do you know that? Fun fact. We found out on chips, the Wild don't lose on Sundays. Because they would always <laughs> fade the Wild on Sundays. And I'm in. Yeah. Hey! I'm in. All right. Let's go Wild! Wow. Minnesota, throw, throw 150 on it. Ooh. Throw 150 on it. 150 on it. Hey, hey, we, we learned, we learned love, in this show wow. that Damn, on Sundays, the Wild go cray. <laughs> wild, thank you for so much, so much during the season. He, just, he just put up a hat trick the other night. I'm having a feeling like... Vasilevsky is gonna uh, no Tarasenko. Mm. Vasilevsky. Okay. I have a feeling he's gonna come in hot, hit it again. Good choice. Bro, good, choice. good choice. Good choice. Kiprasov. I have a thing Sorry, about man. not buying jerseys of 
teams uh, like in the league or sport of a team that I really support, like the Sharks. But God damn, every time I see the Minnesota Wild Green they're jersey, sick, right? I'm getting those. Oh Hell my yeah. God, so I clean! Said, I already said if they, so clean. If they went back to oh no, three times in and a they row. gave us that goalie, man. Thank you, Wild. Well, for the Sharks, yeah. Is he cool? Kakinen? Ka- Is he good? Kakinen? He's young. He's a rookie. Hey, right. by the way, those tickets look stupid. Yeah. Like I, was fun. man, I was way like, to go, Chris. Five. <laughs> shout out, Chris. Shout out, Chris. Shout out, Chris. Gang, gang. It was like five rows back, literally. Yeah, yeah. You know what the coolest thing about seeing hockey that close is it makes it look so much smaller. Mm. Like on TV, it looks very wide and open. Like there's a very small space to really? do the things that they do. Like, oh, okay. like now it made me appreciate like the wild shit like McDavid does. Ooh, it's like you're yes, doing it in God. such the on ice, like then it makes sense. Uh, am I going to run with McDavid maybe? Maybe. I'm thinking either Canes, Florida, or Oilers, of course. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, That's can't go between. wrong with the Canes, yeah. can't go wrong with Florida. I feel like the Canes, Canes have just smoked them too bad that Boston has to have a respectful game. Uh, so I'm not going to say Canes. Uh, Florida did smoke them today. and I, I actually think they're going to probably dog walk them the rest of the series. But you know what? We're going with McDavid. We're going with the Vander Kane. Free Vander Kane. He didn't do nothing. <laughs> Uh, we're okay. going Oilers. Oilers. We're going Good Oilers, choice. and we're going to put a smooth little 80 on this. It's 80. Keep it chill. 80, so I'm up to 250. Okay. We're going to put 80 on this. So was, we're going to get wild in a second. Good. That's what we have. We'll find out Stefan's later. But this now brings us to the personal picks, which every week, now that I'm glad that you had the parlay, because every week for the personal picks now, we've changed it to what you have to have a parlay. So yours was good. I'll have to do the odds on yours, because that shit might be stupid. <laughs> but... <laughs> um, let's go ahead and start with uh, is that Stefan's we have first? No. He was first place. He was first place. So we're gonna go ahead and do his. Uh, he said, and, and we'll call him later to get all of the, his his before I will talk through it without him. Mm-hmm. He said uh, Memphis Warriors this weekend. Okay. Memphis wins. Okay. And then he said Suns Mavericks Suns win. That gave him a plus three sixty seven on that Ooh. one. Uh, so, Suns win, Mavs win. Uh, we'll find out how many he's putting on it later. Does okay. anybody want some of this action in any sort of way? You riding, you fading with, with, with 50. Uh, second let's place go, would be you. Go. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see. Um, I'm going to take that. But I'm going to go the opposite way. I'm going to go Mavs. I'm going to go Warriors. In this this next game, I don't know what odds are on that, but we're gonna go ahead and put a hundred on Mavs Warriors because we gotta get this half off. Um, I'm up to like three fifty right now. I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna rock with you on that one for sure. Um, I'm at how much already? You're at because you went two hundred yeah. one eighty. You're at three eighty right now. So you need you only need seventy really for the rest of it. And of course you're gonna do yours. Yeah yeah, I'll just. Um I'll do a nice little 35 on that one. 35 like on that? Yeah, right with him? Sure. Okay. Yeah, I'll rock that for sure. Danny. Uh, I'm going to pass for now because I want to put up my parlay first. And Fair. then see how much you put up on that one. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I feel that. I feel that. Danny not, with the, not, the classic. It's not a chips episode unless Danny circles back. You know, and, I mean, and, and I'm starting to feel what James was feeling at, at, at the beginning of the season. <laughs> got it out the mud. <laughs> Trevor, Trevor, come back up. You got to get all in on this. Yeah. How much I got left? So you went, um, you went double on the first one. No, yeah. So it's one sixty, and then you just did fifty percent. So he's at seventy percent total of all his chips. Oh, he did fifty percent. Oh, no, 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 I did one fifty. Oh, one fifty. Oh, yeah, I, I thought you like, said fifty percent. I was like, hey, man, get it. One fifty. You up to three ten. You got so, 490 to, to fill out here. I'm going to one flip that. I'm going to go Warriors. I don't want to bet on a pissed off Draymond at home in the playoffs after Curry and Clay shot like 30% combined. They're coming back. I think it's going to be um, Warriors and Suns. Cool, well, not cool stat. When Luka Doncic was in the pick and roll, they averaged 1.8 points per possession against him when he was the defender. Mm. I think I cannot stand CP3 at all anymore at this point in his career. <laughs> and I just this I can't, to watch. but he is going to cook the living hell out of him. There is, Luka doesn't have any help. He's going on, he's going 100 miles an hour on offense. He's doing great things. 
But CP3, Devin Booker, are too smart. They're getting the switches onto him, and they're going to say, hey, you got to defend us the entire time. And you can take your breaks, that's cool, but we're going to score, and you're not going to be able to keep up. Yeah. So I think it's – I'm going to go Warriors, Warriors and Suns for that matter of Luka's going to be – the, the main Just defender too many times. Now, very confident in that. Do you want to maybe up it a little bit and take the spread? I'll give you minus eight on both games. I'll give you minus five, four and a half on Memphis, minus eight on, on the Suns to sweeten it up a little bit. Get your odds a little bit better. Do you feel that? Do you feel like it's going to be I balls? feel that confident with the Suns. I think Warriors is close. Because okay. I still think Jaw is superhuman right now. I don't know if he goes nuclear again, but he puts up, like, 35. He gets to the line. It's all going to be his free throws. If he shoots 90% from the line again, it's going to be tight, tight. But I think it's, like, I think it's a three-point game. Maybe three throws put it over, but I think it's, I wouldn't bet more okay. than a three-point okay. game on that. But so we'll take I think Suns sun, are held. Uh, yeah, money line on the Warriors. Suns minus eight. Okay. Um, minus how much eight? you putting on that? Sheesh. I would put go a hundred on that, Ooh. just on the two. You guys gonna be feeling good because you gotta you have to play everything. Yeah, so that's yeah. like yeah. So that it's brings like nice up to hits, hits. four fifty, I think. And then we'll see, we'll see what Danny. I I know how Danny feels though. Like sometimes you gotta just you got a budget in your head because you don't want to be out. He's not gonna go all in like I was going all in. You see, that's the difference. Shit, you don't know, bro. That's true. That's true. <laughs> when your chips are dead, you gotta down. get your chips out. All you got his one a week. That's all I'm saying. That's, that's always my game plan. Uh, we are gonna go to the next personal pick, which is my personal pick, and we are gonna do. Uh, we're bringing it back. No run first inning, but I'm gonna okay. yes run first inning. Okay, yes. I'm going to go on ball game. I like getting mine out of the way. I like quick first inning, first actual game that happens tomorrow. So I believe that one is, if I'm not mistaken, Dodgers, Cubs, yeah, Pirates, Pirates, Reds. Reds. I'm, doing, I'm doing yes run first inning in both games. Uh, no matter how you split it, no matter how you want to do this, it's plus 250. You said Pirates, Cubs? Pirates, Cubs, and no, 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 Dodgers, Dodgers Cubs, Cubs, Pirates, Cubs. Reds. Um, and I, I'm going to earn that. I'm going to put an 80 on that. I'm going to put an 80 on yes, run first inning. Both of them. Anybody want to take I'm, some I'm of gonna, this? Uh, I'm going to write it. I'm going to write it, and I'm going to put uh, 35 on it. All right. 35 on yes, run? You know, yeah, we'll see what the curse says later, but, you know, maybe the curse didn't get you. got you on the first one, but I'll, take, I'll try to take another crack at your... Baseball pick. Because I feel like the I think I pointed out too the ERAs are nuts. all of these are, are high. Yeah. I feel like the the Dodgers get one. They they hit they there's they're some hitters though. There there's definitely even both all the teams they got some swingers. Pirates Reds is where I'm at, but I feel like they're at the same level mm -hmm. to where somebody scores early. They don't have any big some starting games. pitchers get robbed. Yeah, because even the Dodgers pitcher is not even the best pitcher. Right, right. Think. We can it's get some a, hits. Uh, Kershaw's pitching. Oh, uh, is it? It's Kershaw and Stroman. Stroman was the, he hasn't been great, but he's the Cubs' big sign. He's a sinker baller. Um, but I'll save my opinions for when I got to go. True. Or it's, uh, yeah, your choice. Your turn. If, oh, you're waiting. Yeah, I'm still waiting. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not hard. I'm, you thought he was going to go money, still, wait. I'm so I'm you not, can pick on this one if you want to pick on this one. You can ride it or you can fade I'm not it. riding or fading yet on any of these. <laughs> I might just save my money actually. <laughs> here, to, here to put up the minimum. <laughs> I think already put up fifty percent. Honestly, it's okay, Danny. We'll Almost. get back to you. Almost. Now we got. Uh, <laughs> we now we have. Oh no, not yet. We have Timo. We have the the Timo personal play, and uh, I had got yours in, and I thought it was it was an interesting one. It's one of my favorite that we've had on chip so far. I'm gonna go ahead and let you take the stage here. Uh, yeah. So my personal pick is uh, that I personally believe that I'm gonna have the best week. <laughs> the odds on that is uh, plus four hundred. Um, you guys either riding with me or fading me. <laughs> <laughs> so that you can choose that and then uh, choose who you think is gonna have the best week. I guess. All right, I'm, I'm gonna guess that you're gonna go with yourself. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. all the way, baby. And uh, how much are you gonna put on that? Uh, fifty-three, cause it's my birthday month, and uh, fifty-three, 53. Uh, five and three. Uh, if I had more chips, I would go five hundred and thirteen. <laughs> but now, we'll just take it five and three. You know what I'm saying? Come on, Frank. 
instead of going by BSBs, we'll go by Hit Rate. Because whoever wins the plus thousand usually wins. We'll go uh, by who has the best record. Um, I'm going to see. It's tough because I don't know what the fuck Danny's up to. Like, I don't know what he, I don't know what he's up to yet. Um, what? I'm going to go with, I'm not going to go with myself to have the best week. I'm going to ride the hot one right now. I'm riding Stefan. It's right side, baby. It's right side, gang. And we miss you on the right side. We were holding it down. I'm putting 53 also. I thought you were going to put it on me, bro. Absolutely not. <laughs> That's a, a falling ship over there. I'm, I'm putting yeah, 53 yeah. on Stefan. Don't let me down with some black shit later. <laughs> we'll check in with Stefan later. Uh, Trevor, I don't know if you've watched many episodes or, or, or been yeah. keeping up. You see the standings. Who do you think is going to have the best week? Might it be yourself? I do yeah. like... Stefan always seems like he has wild takes, but they're not always that. They're like more calm. He just makes it seem wild. Yeah, for sure. So he's always. like... No, they're wild, bro. Tricking everyone they're into fucking thinking wild. he's more wild than he is. He a wild boy. But... Scary. I don't know. I like. I might have to go with DJ, rolling in with the uh, hot hand, rolling in with the hot hand, rolling in with picking the Warriors too. Didn't expect that out of him. No, he picked Memphis. He picked Memphis. Um, we faded his. Pick. So that's what I'm saying. Yeah. You, you think? Yeah, you guys both faded. So basically, you're kind of you're, you're contradicting yourself you're, right you're, now, you're, bro. You're hedging your bet. That's what it's. Oh no, no no, James picked. James picked the Warriors. Yeah yeah yeah. Okay exactly. yeah, yeah yeah. I'm yeah. hitting. I'm rolling hard with him. I like that. I like to think I would come in hot, but it's okay. I'll roll in. I still hope the wild roll me through hard, roll me strong. I don't know if that means anything, but <laughs> <laughs> I'm, hit the good one. I'm throwing. I'm throwing fifty on uh, fifty on James. Fifty on James. 50. All right. First place, second place. Right side. Either way, we win it. Right, right, right side. side. Right, right side. side. Gang. Danny is the turn of the tide. At the turn of the tide, he's waiting. That's cute. He's budgeting right now. I'm gonna let Danny go ahead and do his parlay. Let's go ahead and move to can Danny's parlay. Can I can I add it, my pick? I'm gonna put 25 on my boy. I just <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know what? Left side's gonna have edge. <laughs> well, I'm guys, gonna hedge, I'm gonna hedge my my left side pick. I'm gonna have Money a great week. All right, I'm gonna have a great week. So oh. you're gonna bet on yourself. <laughs> Relax. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not there yet. <laughs> All right. That's funny. My turn now, right? Yes, yeah, sir. All right. right. Pam, the camera, please. Put it on me. Waiting. There we go. All right. Now, you know, last week, I shot 50% when it came to my parlays, you know? Uh, but this week, we're going to hit Oh, 100. before we get into that real quick, uh, can you tell us how the game went down for Real? Uh -huh. <laughs> and mind you, mind you. Hey, uh, Curse, uh, who'd you pick? Who'd you pick? Man first? City. Man City. Man City, you oh, feel me? Got it, got it. Hey, got look, it. look. I don't know this is, man. So this is why I wore my Real Madrid jersey today. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, there it is. You know, to give me that extra magic that Ooh, they just that had man. yesterday. Uh, all right, real quick. Real Madrid down against City in aggregate by two goals. Uh, was looking bleak, you know. 90th minute came around, they were like, great, we're down, we need two goals to tie to force extra time. We don't know, we, it, the odds of it happening were not good. Actually, the Plus odds, 4, 000, uh, 4, the, odd, the odds, the, the percentage wise was 99 to 1 percent uh, when it hit the 90th minute of Real Madrid equalizing or winning, whatever it was. It was 99 percent to 1 percent, the chances. They scored in the 90th minute. 45 seconds later, they score in the 90th plus one minute. Tie game. Tie the series or the legs. Force extra time. They get a penalty. It and happened that way? The penalty shot? Yeah. yeah. King, Shut the fuck King, up. King Kareem. So the, so the literally the worst outcome for Man City happened. Yeah, by they, far, even they, down to a penalty yeah, shot. They, to win they, 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 they felt oh, big, they felt yeah, big body man. Benzema, big body oh, Benzi, man. King Karim in the box, won, kicked it in. They win like. 3 2. And now they're in the final oh, against Liverpool. And believe me, depending on how much chips I got, once that week comes around, we're getting spicy. Big or, 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 or I might be eating, eating spicy. Yeah. <laughs> Should I get spicy down? either way. Yeah, yeah. spicy oh, either spicy. way. Either way, that's a spicy meat. When your chips are down, you should get spicy. <laughs> spicy meat, <laughs> <laughs> All right, so.
So, but anyways, we doing another soccer parlay here. Because mm-hmm, mm-hmm. that's what we're going to do here. It's an interesting one, too. We're going to go first with the, the top two teams right now in the MLS are facing each other this weekend. Philadelphia Union, LAFC. Uh, I'm going to go over two and a half goals in that game. So, yeah. That's the first one. Okay. Second game, it's an English Premier League game between uh, Brentford and Southampton. Uh, like I said, I'm going to be nice because last time y'all were getting a booty tickled because I wasn't giving you the right information. He's <laughs> 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 a scammer, dude. Scammer, dude. Scammer, dude. Right. He said that. I swear to God, he made up like two <laughs> London cities or two counties or some shit. I don't know. Okay, so these two teams are mid-table teams. Brentford is 14th, Southampton is 15th. They're both tied with 40 points. Okay. Brentford holds the tiebreaker in goal differentials, mm-hmm. but mm-hmm. they're you know they're pretty equal. Yeah, okay. All right. All right. I'm also going over two and a half goals in that two game. Two overs, huh? Yeah. Because right. uh, I'm you know my boy Erickson, Southampton. <laughs> he plays for Southampton. Yeah. So. Okay. All right. Were those teams on Ted Lasso, or uh, yeah. that's, that's what I would know? Uh, right. I don't know I don't these so. random cities. He, I swear he made up some fucking <laughs> some FIFA created team. <laughs> but you know what? We're riding with Daddy Soccer parlays <laughs> this week. I don't know why at this point, but you almost hit everything last week. You, we were both almost up. So you know what? Yeah, but you were. I meant, I meant Brentford. He <laughs> sounds empty. Timo was up. <laughs> yeah. Oh, good. Eric said. Yo, yo, I mean, I'm, I'm picking the over anyway. We're riding with Danny's soccer pick. You know what? Because he has no choice but to win. I like the desperation. I remember when I was once a young lad in chips <laughs> and had the same the same issues. So you know what? A chips first. I'm putting 53 to ride with Danny. And I'm going to give him five BSBs to, I don't need to it. make it a little bit more. I'm sure. It. Do you have I enough over there, Sam? <laughs> I don't need it. Sir, I'll, take his five. I'll, need it. I'll take his five. I'll take his five. I'll need it because I'm, I'm putting up 100. Oh. Well, okay. <laughs> oh, you know what? Hey, got to get your chips up. You know what? Chips up, baby. No, right, so no, what are the two go. games you got? South right, I'm no punk. I'm going 100 with Danny. Oh, we're going down dude. together if we go down. We're going I'm down going 100 with Danny. All right. We're right All right. with the Ted Lasso. <laughs> Ted Lasso. What was the two games? Uh, so LAFC for the Philadelphia Union, uh, pretty much the top two. Uh, the, uh, <laughs> the top two teams in the MLS are facing each facing off so it's over two and a half on that one, and then Southampton, Brentford, also over two and a half on that one. Ooh. All right. So I'm gonna um, I'm gonna leave it up to the universe. Can you pass me that coaster real quick? Why don't you ask the eight ball? Oh, uh, in how chat, that work? in the chat. Yeah, just um, mention eight ball. Like, should say, should you fade or should you? It's like exclamation no, no, point no, yeah, eight yeah. ball. Well, I just want to know who. Uh, yeah, which game I should pick? Boom, boom, boom. All right, cool, cool, cool. That's what I'm like. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. How do you guys say eight ball? Uh, exclamation point eight ball, and then ask it your question. It's like a yes or no. It's yeah. going to take. Maybe so, we got to do both games. Southampton, yeah. My boy Erickson or, for Brentford. I don't know why I thought that happened. Was it? What was the other one? It's um, oh. LAFC. LAFC. Oh no no. Well, did you know about uh, who, oh, from the, so the English game, Southampton versus Brentford. Yeah yeah, but then uh, but what I'm saying is is Southampton or um, the other game because oh, uh, which oh. one I, which one it chooses is the one I'm gonna go under. Oh okay. Because I'm fading it. Uh, LAFC and Philadelphia Union. I'll put Philadelphia Union. Put Philly Union. My boy Erickson about to score two goals this weekend for Brentford. Look deep in your heart and you will see the answer. Yeah, that's fucking. That's well, well. <laughs> well. All right. Uh, let's see what happens when. <laughs> Did I do it right? Look deep in your heart, bro. No, you're supposed to type eight ball. Oh, type. Summation point eight and then B A L L. Summation point eight ball. <laughs> fade it, fade it. Eight ball, okay. Southampton. Yeah, there you go. Now you now you would get an answer, boy. Versus Philly Union. Give me a, give me a good answer. Let's see what we got. Well, let's see what we got. 
What? Old no, thing, so, Kim so, Smoke follow. Someone's following. Oh, hey, yo, shout out, shout out, Kim Smokes. Damn. Okay. Thank you. Oh, yeah, also Femboy earlier. Hey, hey yeah, shout out, shout out yeah, to yeah, you. Yeah, shout shout out, out to the new followers. Thanks for us up. Uh, they, they, they follow and like you, dog. All right, you gonna have to. Okay, flip me, flip me. Backside is uh, Southampton. Top side is. But it's an over under. Huh? It's an over. I know, I know, but it's just gonna. I, I, I. Okay, so that means I will go under in the MLS game, and I will go over on the Premier League. I flipped heads. It, it should say it. Heads tells me you should do the opposite. So you're fading and writing. <laughs> so yeah, I'm writing one, but I'm fading the other one. And you're fading the uh, MLS going under? MLS is going under. If they're saying the two top teams, I kind of want them that way too, but I want to leave it up to you. Because I feel like when it's always the two top teams, they always kind of play slower. They kind of like, I don't know, it just seems yeah. like that to me. But that's must, my idea. You must have not watched enough MLS games, bro. <laughs> hey, we'll find out. Yeah. Mm. It's going to be a tight defensive game. All right, let's see what we have. It's going to be a tie, 1-1. One, one. Then you got to go ahead and, and make all your picks now because we're getting ready to get to 50, so we're going to need the rest of you. All right, let's see here. <laughs> all right, so what was yours again? Uh, I'm going to have the best week. Oh, or right. you could pick whoever you think is going to have the best week. I'm not touching that one. Uh, you said the first, uh, it was the, I'm going to ride with, with, with James over there. And I'm going to go 50 on that, on his. Hey, boy. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> I hate this fucking game. <laughs> hey, boy. I hate you. And man. then I'm doing uh, just the same thing as uh, Trevor did with Stefan's. I, Warriors are going to win. Suns are going to beat the hell out of the Mavericks. And I'm going to go another 50 on that one. All right. And I think I'm good right there. Yeah, I'm pretty good too. I think I went over a little bit of 50%, but whatever. You can pick it up now. All right, so we're going to go ahead and. Should write all these. We're going to get the 50 call in, actually. I should write all these down, actually. Three pawns? Three pawns? Is he calling? They hate it. Do you have a. Hit his his thing (laughs) (laughs) there. Bring 50s out of invisible. Oh, he's gonna be behind us? Cool. No, get like his, his the 50 call. I am, I am. Can I poke him? Mm-hmm. I am. Mm-hmm. It's like what the weatherman does. As you can see over here, this guy <laughs> sucks. <laughs> this guy's trash. And who let this guy in here? <laughs> <laughs> the weatherman said there's a light chance of snow. Hey. This will be the first attempt on live. Hey. Recording to do a live chat video call. Yes, sir. You know, and if it works, maybe in the future, yeah, some of your followers want to, you know, want to give a phone in and give us your picks or want to pay somebody, like, just for the hell of it. Came smoke, show us what you smoke. Hey! Yeah. 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 Cinco de Mayo! Yeah. Woo! Yeah. 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 Fifth of May. Fifth of May. Fifth of May. Uh, May the 4th. With you? Oh, I missed it. Dang. Revenge of the fifth. <laughs> or Revenge is. of the sixth. There they both rhyme. There you go. Either one. I'm with that. Actually, hit the link. One of my favorite things to do at, at, uh, at work is sometimes we have translators for like Spanish speaking patients. And I just try to make him say the funniest words I can to nice. get me through the day. Like, all right, now we're going to chicken wing. And you just keep saying it. And it. Like, I understand a little bit, so I know they're not saying chicken. Unless I hear pollo in there, like, you aren't saying chicken wing, yeah. and you just say it. So I'll keep going, like, chicken wing. I love the pollo. Chi- yeah, there <laughs> it is. I love the pollo. <laughs> uh, pollo so alas. Today I had to say, all right, we're going to get sassy. So I want you to get sassy, hand on hand on the hip, sassy. And then hand down here. And I just wait sassy. for him to say because he'd be like, la cadera. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, no, 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 sassy. And then you go. Sassy. And then you go. 
va, va, va. <laughs> yeah, it's that, 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 that's it right there. Well, what did Buck do that? I don't know. It was, it was like, it's a song. Cool. In the flower. They started with this, uh, <laughs> what, they, and for Sassy, oh, they said like, co coqueta or something. <laughs> co yeah. yeah. Cochita. <laughs> Cochita, I don't remember. That's and I was funny. like, that's what I want to do. Yeah, yeah, that's that's it. hilarious. That's I like that. Right gets like, me, sass, gets sass, me through sass. the day sometimes. I I like that. But you haven't told us, well, like, I guess you haven't told everyone, and me included, what's, what's the job? What's, what's Oh, I'm a licensed uh, doctor of physical therapy. Woo! Woo! Yeah. Uh, yeah, and we're going to have a, uh, another show um, more focused on health and wellness uh, later down the road, but that's to be continued. Woo! A little sneak peek if you watch this episode. Woo! Yeah, focus on some health, Woo! some fitness, some educated talk of things <laughs> yeah, involving the body yeah. i promise cool kind of smart yeah if you ever knew but... what the love line was this is like the health line eh yay so yes. but yeah that's the idea dr t and team you know that's, maybe that's true. <laughs> maybe we maybe we see an injury and during a sporting event and then we he just we talks about it that's true. oh yeah yeah we could talk about the injury that the curse had all the cursed injuries that has happened uh we could talk about uh anthony <laughs> oh, davis yes. Uh, we could talk about uh, who else was it? Uh, OBJ in the Super Bowl. Uh, oh just to name a few. Yeah, brutal. Yeah, exactly. See, uh, we'll talk about those, and we'll just break down every curse injury uh, to start off the the shows. Hey, y'all see y'all see OBJ at the oh, game? Hey, that was awesome. Hey, fifties are right now. Hey, hey Stefan. Hey, man, you suck. Hey, look at him. Hey, focus nose, focus nose. This guy sucks. Focus nose, focus nose. This guy sucks. Oh, focus nose. Doesn't argue. All right. Boom! Boom! Ah, you changed the camera when I threw the bottle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see how that works. We lost him. He hung up. He hung up! Yeah, you heard too much bullshit. That guy sucks. Put the intro on, put the intro on. You're gonna have to send him a fresh link, by the way. Oh, that was almost there. No, he's right there. Oh, there he is! Hey! Hey! Where's my bottle at? Some pee on the couch. There it is. We can hear you. All right. Stop hanging up. <laughs> Stop hanging up. Stop hanging up. Can you hear us, though? That's the thing. Hey, can you hear us, 50? The lightning's the charger for the keyboard. Oh, you can't hear it because it's through the mat. All right, so, uh, 50, can you hear us? Try to take a delay. Oh, oh, he hears it through the stream. Ah. All right, 50, uh, go ahead, and uh, we're going to run you through what we have so far. Do, do you have a over, um, what is it, 82.1 million for Doctor Strange 2? Nope. Oh. He probably does not. He doesn't hear us. Can't hear it. Can you connect your headphones to the... It is not working. He said over. <laughs> <laughs> All right, tell us in the chat. Yeah, it's cool. It works. It works. Yeah, just tell us in the chat. Oh, he's back. Hey, what, what, what push -ups? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <That's laughs> Sneak it in. That's cool. And we're just back to the stream. Okay. Magical. Danny, what, what push ups do you have? I don't even know. I, I thought I had nothing. Do them anyways. I thought you were going to Yeah, so basically, yeah. he doesn't know what's going nah, on. No, he doesn't know. <laughs> he just wanted push ups from Danny, so that makes sense. <laughs> Uh, 50, what, um, uh, tell us in the chat, 50, uh, yeah, what, what, chat, what NHL uh, team do you have scoring the most this week? We're going to see in a moment, we're going to see in the chat. He wants 200 on his parlay. Two. Okay, so he's putting 200 on his parlay. 200 on his parlay? Okay, okay. So he's going 200 on the, that would be Memphis. Yeah, and Mavericks. And that's plus 367. Mavericks? He went Mavericks? No, no, he went no, Suns. He went Suns. I thought he went Suns. I swapped it. Yeah, yeah. So we need to do a wet and chill team. Hey, he's 
he's in the he's in the actual chat. Okay. So he's got two hundred, he has to go um ten percent on his first one. So that's hundred thirty. So he's three thirty. He needs six hundred. Yeah, he has a. He's he trade dirty. He went right. over. He's kidding. He Don't worry. Over. He's gonna put all Bush in on my in parlay. Shell team. He's doing all in on my parlay. Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. So you now you gotta you uh, your oh, pick your. We haven't used your parlay yet. No. You know what? Fifty. You're watching right now. I think you're gonna like this. Uh, what is the? Go ahead and let us know. So I'm going for. Uh, unexpected because I absolutely hate this guy too, so I don't know why I'm going with him. But I'm going James Harden. Um, we'll make this an actual. So over 39 and a half combined points, assists, rebounds, Ooh, that's and cool. I like those. parlay it with a win. Ooh, I so like that. So they're gonna send the uh, Scott Foster. They're gonna send the extender over there, mm. and James Harden's gonna he every game. He increased his free throws by a lot, or by, he I guess by a lot. Yeah, he, he, went, he went. He only shot four the first game. He shot seven the next game. Has not missed a free throw in the series. I think he gets to the line thirteen to fifteen times, like and he just should. puts up, you know, thirty-five and five, something like that. Or he's okay. going twenty, ten, and ten. And getting the win. I wanted to do like a triple double or like a twenty five eight and eight, but I was like, that's getting too peachy with it. Just he's gonna score a lot. He's gonna be in a lot of pass and do everything. Yep, and he's gonna when he does it, because he might shoot like forty percent, but he's gonna get to the line and he's gonna shoot fifteen free throws and sink fourteen of them. Yo, I like that. Very creative. That was a very creative also parlay. Sixers with, win. with Sixers win, so I'm parlaying that with the Sixers win. I think Scott Foster, they're gonna want. They're not going to want the Sixers with all this excitement to get swept because they don't want that to be blown up. They want that to be a story. They want Harden and B. That's going to be awesome for the league in general. I don't believe in conspiracies, but I believe the league wants that to be not a sweep. And I think it's an easy True. game one. Get Harden to the line. Get him a game. Make make it a series. Win one of the earlier ones and make that into kind of at least a 5-6 gamer. Makes sense. I like it. Uh, How much you putting on? He's gonna put the rest on. I'm putting. Do we still got another parlay on it? Nope. No, that's it. That's it. it. You basically yeah. all in now. Slam all of that. Fuck Oof. yeah. <laughs> on your own parlay all too. All of it. Cool. Yeah. Going hard. Anybody Same riding thing. or fading? Well, um, yeah, I'm gonna. Um, oh, uh, Fifty said he has two hundred on his parlay. Yeah, so we have two hundred on the parlay. He's up to to three thirty right now T on his parlay. Oh, and hit on his team. Oh, literally shit. In the chat. He said, Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, I told you. Yeah, I'm riding with him, actually, oh, too. Shit. Uh, but I'm not going to go that high. I, I Actually, how much am I even at at this point? I'm like 60% in at this point. Uh, what was your What was your on the personals? Uh, I can't remember. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to go 53 because I'm going to have the best week anyway. So, 53. 53, 53 on, right? the, uh, on the. Miss uh, Dr. T, um, uh, Parlet. I'm gonna go ahead and um, before Danny puts his scraps together, <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and I I'm gonna fade it. I'm gonna go 53 and I'm gonna go. Um, I think this. I think they win Game Four when it's out of hand. Mm -hmm. um, but under Harden, um, uh, Heat win. Heat win. Yeah. I think the, the Heat are, although the, that game was closer than I thought it was going to be, but every Heat playoff game has been like, at halftime, you think the team maybe has a chance, the Hawks whole series, down by four, down by five, and then they just been steamrolling. I think that, I think the Heat win this in five, and then I think they lose in the Eastern Conference Finals. I think it's gotten too easy, uh, and I, I think that they lose then. Uh, but I'm, I'm barely under on the hard, and I think it's like one point or one assist lower on that. Uh, but I'm gonna fade that one. We have, to, we have to get to what? 39? 30, 39 and a half. So and like, like and I, I, 35 I, 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 and 5 or something. Cool, I just made a double check. I, 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 I can dig it. See, a, a, a really good Harden game can get you like 10, 11 assists too. It, exactly, yeah. yeah. And Tobias that. Harris is, so my thing is, Tobias Harris has been hitting his shots. He's been, I think he's shooting over 50% on the series. Maxi's been unreal the whole time. He's not going to sit in the corner, but they're going to start, you know, start they're going to take pieces. out, yeah. yeah, they're going to put cork in more, they're going to say, all right, Harden, here you go, here's the, here's the keys, we're going to put a bunch of shooters around, you go fucking do whatever you want to do, and then that's what's going to happen with it. 
Maybe this is the Harden goes crazy game that 50's been saying is going to happen for like <laughs> a, a month. Year, right? And I just hope, I hope it doesn't. Like, I don't like his playing styles. Again, being a Warrior <laughs> fan from like watching him on the Rockets all the years, I don't like watching a guy get to the line 15, 17, 18 times, but like it works and I hate it. But like it is what it is. They just called a palming in the last two minutes report of the Warriors game. I don't know if you guys caught that. The the John Morant drive uh, with a minute left. Um, when they did the last two minute report, the only incorrect call. So they called that Dre rebound as an actual foul, but mm. they called a palming from Ja, which I don't see called very often. I was very I was very like interested to see how many palmings or travels got called in the last two minute reports. I guess not that much. Wow, that's a but that's he odd got call. a full yeah. And it was like, I mean, you saw the replay, and it's like, yeah, that's a palm. But how many times that happened in the NBA game? I'm thinking. So right. I'm like, I don't know how many things. Because he's he goes so fast and slow that it's like, his jerk is so good, but he just does one of those over. So I think reps are going to start calling a lot more. I think, especially after the Warriors series and Chippy, I think that's going to carry over to the other ones. I just want to say it's really refreshing outside of Danny to come up to come with the facts and the homework done. <laughs> Like, shots, or shots, so shots, 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 shots. Look at this is the thing. This is the thing. I know. Mary's were thrown on this man. He came here prepared. And Danny too. You know, what? Danny. Danny's in last place. What? <laughs> I still come with the facts though. I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't matter. That's well, cool and all. It does, he shows his work whether he gets it right or wrong. Cool exactly. But when it does, I just let uh, I take Danny's homework. I copy the homework. We ride Danny. Yeah, exactly. See, 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 I always used to like the teachers back in elementary school where in math class or the math portion, they're like, as long as you show your work, you still get some points. But, like, if, but if the answer is wrong, <laughs> you, don't get full, you don't get full credit. I used to get in trouble for not showing my work. Danny, kids, so I can't support it. One last thing here. That, yeah, uh, yeah, this guy was just telling me right now. We, so are you going to take that before we get into our last segment? No. Ooh. No, even though it's very tempting, but it's like, it's like how, like, it's good. Like, who, who does Memphis really have to score all the points compared to the Warriors? Like, this may be the game where finally Clay and Curry are not shooting poorly, and then at least pull out. Bain, but Bane's been, Bane's been cobbled. He is hurt. Something's wrong with his back. I don't know what is on the injury report, but he is not. He looks. He was the one I was scared of this this year. No, yeah, yeah. No, he, very, he, very he is. He is kind of. But I was just. I don't know. He doesn't look right. He doesn't look good. I think he's amazing. I think he's hurt, yeah. and something's gonna. He's gonna have like back surgery or something. Yeah, I know. What just scares me is just the like. There's just too many options when it comes to the Warriors. I agree, but Poole's gonna get hit at this point. Uh, Clay isn't doing well enough with the ball. He's working really hard on defense. He's just like slow on defense too. Yeah, he doesn't have that same gear, which is okay. Yeah, it makes a sense. Different. Yeah, you know, but I and think, I think he, just, he just doesn't, he doesn't handle trust the ball. His, yeah, he doesn't trust. He's not trusting his body. I mean, of course not. There, too many there was a weird dynamic between um, Poole and Clay Simmons that I was listening to Bill Simmons' podcast on. Uh-huh. And um, between, yeah, between Clay and Poole of where Clay was kind of open at the, at like the top left arc and Poole like dribbled it into the right back corner mm-hmm. and then like looked him, looked him off kind of and then came back and drove to the hoop and got fouled and came down and then like I had a little bit of chirping with him, and I mean, if anyone's good, like he has earned his right to chirp at somebody, but it's a weird dynamic that when Clay has like an off game, is he gonna get chippy about not getting the ball as much? So I think Pool still, I think Pool averages twenty five this whole series. Yeah, yeah, yeah makes sense. easy. Now we hey, have fifty. Where you at? Which, which camera is it? Which camera is it? Fifty, fifty, fifty. Stefan, I'll take that fifty. Oh, <laughs> it's in. All right, so the bet is uh, Bane uh, will outscore Pool. But I'm saying Pool will outscore. But you're saying Pool, he's going to fade it. All right. All right, cool. All right, you know what time it is. Hockey teams? Huh. It's not that time. <laughs> it's time for the Butters Curse. Oh! oh. oh. He is. There's a guy. Here he is. Butters, you know how this works. Oh yes, we do. We do. We definitely do. So let's go ahead and start from the top. Wait, can we can we start off? How many did he hit last week? Any? <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
That's I just want to know if he hit any. <laughs> I think I did, bro. I think oh, there's. He always gets one. I just want to know what the one was. So he hit the. Butters did not hit any. <laughs> no way. No, he hit the, the wild over Capitals open. Oh, I did. Okay. You get one. You get one. You get one. Wild don't play. <laughs> wild don't play. Wild. Not wild, on Sundays. No. That was wild. Dang, Friday. I should have seen that. I would have picked the wild too. Dang it. Shit. Good so, game. Butters, we have Doctor Strange, eighty-two point one million, over under. First week. First week. I I think it might go under, man. It might go under. Yes. Going under or under? Going under? On a Marvel movie? On a Marvel movie. Yeah, right. we're going under on that. We're going under. On that. Okay. All right, we have NHL team that will score the most of all the playoff teams. So this is Saturdays. And this is Hey, Sundays. pick the Avalanche, bro. The Wild? Wild on Sunday, though. The wild one on Sunday. They got to ride with it, bro. Oh, Trevor it. getting the experience. Oh. Wild <laughs> Hey, even radio scores a touchdown. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Butters, we have, um, what do we have Warriors, next? Warriors, uh, Memphis. Warriors, Memphis, and uh, Warriors, Memphis, who you got? Oh, we know Memphis, baby. Memphis finna win. Yes. Memphis finna win that game. Yes. Memphis finna win that game, man. Yes. That's All right. right. Job love about it. to go love off. It. Love it. Love Again. it. I love that. Plus 40. I love that. Plus 40. Plus I'll that. take, uh, okay, really now I'll let you ride your picture. So first, we have uh, Suns Mavericks. Suns Mavericks. Suns. Suns about to smack all Sheesh. of them. Let's go! Suns about to smack all Sheesh. of them. Let's go! Oh, Sheesh. Too nasty. Let's Sheesh. Go. Best week ever, baby. Luka gang. I don't know. Luka gang. We are going uh, um, no run, or yes run first inning. Dodgers versus Cubs. Pirates versus Reds. First inning? So Dodgers versus Cubs, do they score in the first inning? No, they don't. Do all right, not. all right. I like that. Then we have uh, Pirates versus Reds. Do they score in the first inning? They do score in the first inning. Fuck. 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 Pirates. <laughs> pirates score. First. So the Pirates, pirates Reds, score first. Pirates Reds, the, the Reds pitcher is a very highly touted prospect, Nick Lodolo. Nick Lodolo. But he's had like an off start. Yeah, his year But he's got race. some nasty stuff. Okay, that's cool. He's that's got some stuff. gnarly nasty stuff. Still raw, though. No, Still but raw. do we go... Um, is is Timo gonna have the best week? Timo gonna have the best week. Yeah! <laughs> I'm gonna get one. Yes. That's the one. That's yes. the one. That's Thank what's you. up. Yes, that week, goodbye. Yeah, right. That's what's up. I love it. I like that. And you then, got uh, screwed. Yeah. <laughs> it's cool. It's cool. Um, LAFC. For the Philadelphia. Over two, two and, and a half. half. Over. Fuck. Okay. Now, it's, now it's all changing. It's gotta be a good week. And the then um, Brentford for the Southampton also under. over two and a half. Oh, two uh, unders. All right, cool. Unders. Maybe he gets one right, and I hope he's the other one. Well, so right. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. And then we have um, James Harden. Does he go over thirty nine and a half? Oh, I didn't think about that when I took this fucking well, you know, bet. Oh. All I gotta tell but you. But he's is, playing the best two guard in the league. Yeah, but I'm just saying, who's the, who's the number one two huh? guard in the league? Who's number one two guard? You already said. Who? 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 Who is it? I don't know. You tell me, bro. Butler, is it? isn't it? Jimmy it's Butler? Butler? It's Butler. Or so is now Harden the best two guard now? Who's the best two, guard, two guard now? Depends on the week, bro. So who is it? Who is it? It's <laughs> on the week. Oh, okay, so is it Harden or it Jimmy Butler? He's shaking. <laughs> <laughs> so who is it? Jimmy Butler or is it... We call James Harden, baby. Over, baby. Let's go. God damn it. Let's right. fucking go, baby. Well, do the Sixers win. about the ball. Do the Sixers win? No, they don't. Our okay. lives in play, baby! <laughs> 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 I can take that. I can Miami take that. Can take. So you still say Miami wins, but Harden, Harden goes, goes over. He yeah, does. He good. He does good. At least, at least we know. We have a shot. <laughs> we, we have a shot. We could cheese it on a last second. Uh, Harden <laughs> That's cool. rebound. That's cool. Good he thing I only went fifty-three. He gonna be hunting. I'm just glad he didn't pick the Avalanche because I have my most money on the Avalanche. Oh my That's god. Good. That's it. Like that's cool. I, I lost. Well, on Sunday. That's cool. Why well, went on Sundays? As long as you didn't pick Avalanche. N fifty of course says FML. <laughs> <laughs> There it there. is. And that is the Butters curse, baby. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Thank you, Butters, for ruining our day every single time. Yeah, you know, shout out, that's how uh, we do every time. Shout out uh, Man City one time. Man shout City, out Man City for losing. 
Yeah. Danny, did you get any of the uh, butter's curse today? Uh, you got a little bit. It was a mix because I I, I put. He kind of went around. He split a lot of them. them. He split a lot of them. Yeah. What a dick. We're gonna all fucking lose. Let's go, baby. We get one Let's now. Let's go. Right now. I went, I went, it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Because I, I went. I, I rode with you that there are gonna be runs. I put fifty on there. I rode with fifty on. Warriors and Suns winning. Well, you went, he went Memphis. No, I know, I know. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm. I'm oh, you're going with, with that one. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Warriors and Suns are winning. And we're trying to fix? Um, what else did I do? He I, picked Suns, right? Yes, I yeah, picked Suns. Yeah, so and then good. we're good on that part. And yeah. then I also did fifty on Pool and Baines. Oh yeah. Uh, fifty Avalanche wants to smoke. <laughs> yeah. I want to. And overtime. and you had Pool. He had had Bane. Yeah. Okay. I think that's it. Like literally, right now, out of the five fifty one that I started with this week, I'm down to sixty four. Oh, he kept a little. Wait, speed. butters. What's your pool bane thing? Oh, I'm the curse. No, but pool. That's or what bane. I'm saying. Oh, oh pool or bane. Who's, Who's scoring bane? more points next pool game? Pool or bane. Oh, I didn't get to that one. Yeah. Well, go ahead. Let us know. Yeah, let us know, baby. Come on. Was it over under? No, 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 <laughs> We're going bang, baby. Right. We're going bang. Oh. I, I never been, got a chance to make a bet, but I'm going to go pool. <laughs> <laughs> I'm taking everything on that, actually. Actually, I'm going to just shit put, all my put my, last, <laughs> put my last 64 on there. <laughs> I'm cool. glad you guys talked about it, but coming soon, maybe in the next couple weeks, we got the Dr. Trevor and Tino Trevor. Doctor. Tino Tre doctor. Tino An actual doctor. The doctor Licensed. in the house. You'll be able to send in your health and fitness questions to our in house oh, doctor facts. and trainer. Uh, what, what, what days do we got the games? Mine is first thing in the morning tomorrow. We, see mine <laughs> as uh, we okay. got Saturday, we got Sunday. Um, one of the soccer games. Uh, uh, let me look up the uh, the date for yeah, that. Yeah, he be giving us the mid oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So we had to wait until Wednesday. Hey, <laughs> hey, hey wait till it, Wednesday. it keeps it interesting it though. though. That's true. We literally had to wait for the day before the, uh, our show. That's <laughs> what I miss about our Sunday our Sunday picks. But you know, uh, now we could go all the way to Wednesday now. Apparently, so. Boom, yep. It's fireworks, Cinco de Mayo weekend. Mile, fireworks, you know what I'm saying? Uh, let's see. Dang, the Mexican team couldn't win before Cinco de Mayo. Uh, LAFC. Oh. LAFC in Philadelphia is the last game on Saturday. Okay, cool. We got a Saturday. Uh, 8 p.m. kickoff. And the other game, I believe it's Saturday, but let me double check. The last one is technically you, because we won't know who, who will win it all. Oh, yeah. To the end. Like, Oh, uh, Brentford South Southampton Saturday at seven a.m. So the last one is actually going to be the last Sunday team to play. Well, actually, when's the Sixers game? Is that tomorrow? Yes. So you got tomorrow. Oh, the Wild on Sunday too. So I think Wild on Sundays. No, Sunday. No, to, oh, no, tomorrow. Tomorrow. Sixers, Sixers is tomorrow. Six tomorrow. Oh, like, six tomorrow. It's like six yeah. six thirty game or something. Yeah. Ooh, Sunday. Sunday. The night. This is the last Sunday game. The the two the two the two series that are two and zero are tomorrow, which is Ooh. the Suns. Ooh, the Oilers. And then, um... Oilers will be the last game. So yeah, the I got the last game. All right. The Heat Sixers at four. Um, without somebody... Actually... It would be Trevor. It would be the special guest to call you it You know up. what? Trevor, Have thanks for joining us today on When the Chips Are Down. We oh. hope that your chips are up next time we see you. <laughs> but go ahead and, and lead us out here. Thanks for being with us. Um, when the chips are down. When the chips are down. Get, get your, your chips, chips up. up. <laughs> we did it.